Sustainability means living within one's means and trying to minimize the amount of waste one produces. Mostly it's about the idea of having these different systems of material use and consumption and looking at new ways of how we can reuse them and reconstitute them. We had all pretty much conceived of this as the method of consumption and disposal. So in terms of this project, we wanted to focus on materials that we consume on a day-to-day -day basis. We uh, researched paper, plastic, metals, um, and from that we generated two designs that we thought would best go with the competition. We chose um, bottles and hangers, and so they're both very, made of very similar material, PET plastic, but they both have different, very different means of consumption. The first is the bottle tower, which is more obvious uh, ideas about sustainability as uh, everybody uses bottles, but what they may not know is the volume that are wasted each day and our design represents approximately the number of plastic bottles thrown out each day in the Georgia Tech community. Our second approach to sustainability is more hidden in the hangers. Uh, hangers are a commercial product, a product of the department stores and consumers don't see them regularly. What happens with the hangers is that they are thrown out when new hangers arrive to the stores. And some stores recycle, but a lot of them are thrown out. So we wanted to raise awareness for something that's more hidden. We started with uh, vague drawings of what the bottle tower could look like, vague drawings of what the, the hangers would assemble. We've all thought about how the hangers, all the different permutations that the hangers could combine in, all the different permutations that the bottles could combine in. And once we came up with drawings that kind of exhibited those two, we could then take each one of the strengths and weaknesses and then start to um, change how we would start to construct or deconstruct these two things. We got majority of our bottles from Georgia Tech Recycling and they had facilities members leave out the plastic recycling on campus. And this is in our student center, our residence halls, all throughout campus. So we've created these acrylic rings that act as simple guides that allow us to create a tower of varying height. So each one of the acrylic rings holds up to 25 courses. 25 courses equals 5 feet. And this gives us a module that allows us to vary the heights based on how we see the bottles to perform. The first step is you take a thicker rubber band and attach it to the back of the, the bottle. And then you take a thinner rubber band and attach it to the front of the bottle. Another challenge was uh, building, building the towers um, without having them collapse. With the hangers, it was a little bit different because the hangers were uh, the, is less com complex connection. The hangers can only really connect one way. So it was all about finding out the best way to minimize the number of hangers we needed to use to establish the same amount of uh, effect we were looking for. In this case, we used roughly 6,000 hangers to create uh, the installation you see before you. You walk through the installation, you look up and you see just you're surrounded by bottles, you're surrounded by hangers, it's just encrusting the space and it's about understanding the impact of both products you use on a daily basis like bottles but also seeing things that are residues of industries like the hangers in the fashion industry. We wanted to create an impressive size so that a lot of people can enjoy it at the same time. We've reached up to a, a 13, 12 to 13 foot height with our bottle tower and I think the floor area probably spans a 20 foot by 20 foot square. The hangers are nine rows by 11 rows area, and the number of hangers we used was roughly 5,300. What really excited me was this kind of modularity. Within both of our projects, we've created two systems that nobody's ever really seen before, or that I've never seen before, and that was, there was no information on. What we've produced is something that uh, has beauty, has a lot of intrigue, and that will be useful in raising awareness about uh, recyclability and sustainability of plastic.